Hey, welcome to this video. If you arrived here, you're probably searching for a view of Builder also. I'll go over how it works and give you my two cents, whether I think it's a good use of your time. I'm always coming out with videos like this, so consider subscribing. And if you like my free training on the number one simplest, fastest way to earn a full-time income from home, working part-time hours, all I have to do is click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I could send you my free training if you want. Builder all. Let's dive in. So what it is, basically, it's an all-in-one software. Um, a one-stop shop for online marketers, similar to, you know, Kartra and System.io. Uh, there's a, several of these types of softwares out there. So instead of having to go out and, you know, find different tools and integrate all of them together, you have everything in one place here. Um, and and the, the USP of Builder, all the unique selling proposition, um, is that you'd be saving money. And, and, you know, and also some people, that's basically it, you'd be saving money. Some people think it's easier to have everything in one place. I would actually debate that. But, um, but so that's why it's just, it's just because you, you want to save money. <laughs> now, um, they offer over 100 features uh, with 50 plus tools. And you can see I'm not going to go over everything because we'd be here all day, but I'll just go over the main features and just delay the groundwork so the rest of this video makes sense. Um, here are kind of the main tools you should have in any online business or any business that you where you have an online presence and you're trying to sell stuff online. So first of all, you must have a page builder. That's what that'll do is allow you to capture people's emails, um, follow up with them in a very nice way because you need to follow up with your prospects and email is the best way to do that. Now, a good page builder will also allow you to build out single pages like you know bridge pages. Um, bonus pages, um, you know, and it's kind of like the backbone of your business. That's one way to think of it. Um, a very popular, I'm sure you've heard of these guys, ClickFunnels. They're everywhere. Um, now, a lot of people will say you must have ClickFunnels. I'm, I'm not going to do that. You know, they're just trying to get you to buy through their affiliate link. But I do think it is the best page builder out there I've found. It is kind of like the Ferrari of funnel builders. Um, you know, it's the simplest, it's the easiest to use. Um, it's the most robust, um, but you don't have to use ClickFunnels, right? There's lots of page builders out there. Um, and then you also need, um, and then also a page builder should allow you to um, split test, capture pages one against the other. It should allow you to have, you know, countdown timers. It should allow you to change, tweak the colors, the text, uh, or the font, um, add buttons. And, and Build It All allows you to do all that stuff. So... Um, and it has it has hundreds of different templates that you can just use as your own or you can tweak them if you want. Um, they're drag and drop builder. It's relatively easy to use. I People think it's easy to use. I found it clunky. I'm just going to be perfectly honest. Um, one nice thing about it is it does allow you to drag the items uh, exactly to where you want. So I, there's, a, there's a term for that. I'm, I forget what it's called. But it's because some page builders... Um, don't allow don't give you that level of freedom but but you know too much freedom is not necessarily a good thing especially if you're not a designer so but it does allow you to drag and drop exactly where you want on the page also their um, pages are uh, responsive uh, to whatever device someone is on so if they're whether or not they're on mobile or they're on you know their ipad which i don't think is, is common now but it'll actually um It'll, it'll adjust automatically, so you don't have to worry about that. So uh, so that's their page builder, and it's the builder all builder right there. And you can learn more by clicking on that page. Now, the second thing you need, which um, builder all also has, is an email manager. Now, their email manager, they call it Mailing Boss. Um, you know, I use, so I use ClickFunnels for my page builder. I use GetResponse for my email manager. You don't have to use GetResponse necessarily. There's others out there, like Aweber and, you know, uh, active campaign and MailChimp. And what an email manager allows you to do is follow up with your prospects via email. Um, you know, whether that's automated emails or live e live called broadcast emails. And that's basically what it's for. You don't, you don't have to overcomplicate it. Um, now, a lot of email managers will allow you to use advanced, like advanced tracking, you know, advanced um, tagging, I don't, I don't, wouldn't worry about that. I like to do things manually, and I suggest you uh, keep things as manually as as manual as you can. Just, just keep things simple. Um, so that's our email manager. Also, you must have a tracker. 
um, which I don't think Build It All really has, unfortunately. Um, I, the best tracker, tracker I found is Click Magic. And what a, tra a good tracker should allow you to do is to um, track how many people are landing on your capture page, what percentage are opting in, and where your leads are coming from. That's very important because if you don't have tracking in place, it's kind of like putting on a blindfold, spinning around 10 times, and trying to hit a target from 100 yards away. Uh, you're just not going to do it. And so you can see, and it's especially important if you have multiple uh, traffic sources. So you can see I have several YouTube channels. I know exactly where my clicks and my leads are coming from. And click, I found Click Magic is the most accurate, and nothing really compares. I, I wouldn't recommend anything other than Click Magic for tracking, to be quite honest. Um, now it can also track sales um, if you sell your own products, but as if you're selling other people's products, you don't really need that necessarily, unless you're using paid advertising, but that's an advanced strategy. Now, so those are the three tools that you need. Builderall has two of the three at least. Now there's some other add-ons that you should have in your business, not as essential, uh, but well, some other actually they're pretty essential, but these are the three big ones where you'll be spending the most money. And then you also, uh, you should have hosting, which Builderall, Builderall has their own hosting. It's very fast. Um, you need, a, you know, at least one domain. I, I recommend having four domains, one for your page builder, one for your e-manager, manager, one for your tracker, and one for your website. You don't want to get them mixed up. It's better to have one for each, keep them separate. And then you need, you should have a website. If you're going to sell stuff online, you know, there will be a lot of people out there who say you don't need a website. All you need is a sales funnel. I, I don't think that's true. You do need a website if you want to sell online. It creates a sort of like a branding and a presence that really just a simple, uh, you know, sales funnel can't do, right? So um, websites are, they still work. They're, they're not going anywhere. Um, and Build It All does allow you to build websites. Um, with their builder all uh, builder for WordPress. So if you want to, um, but you do have to uh, sign up for WordPress, it's free. And um, now you can use your website to get traffic. That's called search engine optimization. I don't really recommend you do that, at least when you're first getting started online, because it can take a while um, to get start getting traffic from Google. It can take at least at least four to six months to actually start seeing any results whatsoever. And most people don't have the patience to wait that long. Um, you know, six, I would say six months at least to see real results. Um, and I'm also not sure how good Build Roll's SEO capabilities are. That's something, I'm not an SEO specialist. That's something you would have to research yourself. And then what else do they have? So Build Roll e-commerce, instead of setting up an e-commerce store on Shopify, um, you, or some of these other platforms, you could do it all on Builderall. It's pretty cool because um, Shopify is quite a clunky uh, platform. And then also, what else could you do? And then you should have some video hosting, which Builderall absolutely has. Uh, where is it? I, I can't find it. It's on there on this page somewhere. Video hosting. And the reason why you want um, a video host is, yeah, you could host all your videos on YouTube. But that just doesn't look very professional. Um, you know, if you're sending people to a bridge page or a sales page and has the YouTube icon up top, that just doesn't inspire a lot of confidence, right? You do need some type of video host. Uh, most of them are very cheap. I think I pay $10 a year for mine. That's Vimeo, something like that. So, but but it is included in Builder also. And then also they have uh, more advanced, what I would consider very advanced features, you know, the bells and whistles the stuff you don't need that I would just stay away from as a beginner because it's more, it's just, you're just gonna get distracted, but they do have SMS capabilities. I don't think people like being marketed to through SMS. I think people find it a bit invasive. I know I do when some marketer shows up in my, I'm like, how did they get my phone number? Um, you know, you know, phone should be for friends and family. It shouldn't be for, you know, business type stuff. You know, at least I don't think so. Um, and then what else? So e-learning, so if you have your own courses, you can build your own e-learning platform in here, pretty cool. And that, that those are the main ones, that's basically it. Um, you can create webinars in here. Uh, now webinars, are it's an advanced strategy. So if you're selling a product that is 
um, in the hundreds of dollars or more, then webinars can be very effective, but it is an advanced strategy. So I don't really recommend getting started with webinars. I've been, I've been online for three years now and I still don't do webinars because I just don't think it's necessary. Um, and, and it takes a while to get good at. What else? Uh, chatbot features similar to Facebook many chats where it all, that this, this AI uh, robot will respond to people based on their um, answers to yes or no questions. So um, again, it's one of those bells and it's, these, one of those bells and whistles that you don't really need in the beginning, but it can be um, a nice tool to add to your toolkit once you're already doing quite well. So, and that's it. Those are Builderall's main features, and this is their dashboard uh, for the fr you, when you get a free account. Um, you can't actually use any of this. You have to upgrade to the paid membership, but it kind you can kind of take a look around, get a feel for it, and they have different uh, you know plans. I, I would upgrade. I would go with at least the marketer plan, seventy six dollars and ninety cents per month. If you get the builder plan at sixteen dollars and ninety cents a month, you only get one domain. And remember, I said you should have four domains ideally, um, and you only get two thousand subscribers. That's not a lot of subscribers because if you're uh, driving fifty to hundred leads a day into your business, which you, you should be, I'm not saying you'll get there overnight, but eventually. You'll, you'll quickly surpass 2,000 subscribers, right, easily. So, and that's it. So I would get at least the marketer plan. I wouldn't worry too much about the premium or the, or this one, Funnel Club. And that's it. So um, all in all, Builderall is a perfectly good software. Again, I tried it. It wasn't my favorite. I found it quite difficult to navigate, you know, a bit clunky. But this was a while ago. I know they have done some updates, and apparently it's easier to use now. So... Um, they're on the 5.0 version now, I believe. But some cons with softwares like this, some all-in-one softwares are, um, first of all, and I'm not picking on Builderall. It's it's the same with Kartra, System.io, all these all-in-one bus um, business-in-a-box softwares is, be first of all, because all your eggs are in one basket, that's just very dangerous. If something happens to your account, um, you know, which it can happen. I mean, things happen all the time. I'm not saying it's right, but you know, this is this is internet marketing and things happen. Um, if something happens to your account, maybe you get shut down or anything can happen, your business is gone like that. Um, so putting all your eggs in, your, in the basket of, you know, putting, you know, relying 100% on one company for your business, I think that's just a very precarious position to be in. Um, whereas with me, I have, so I have a separate software for each, I have a separate page builder, email manager, tracker, and that what that does it 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 makes me more much more resilient. So if something happens to my GetResponse account, that's no big deal. I can just in, I can start using Aweber and insert or create a new GetResponse account. But but I'd probably go with something else if something happens. So um and so that's number one. Another reason why I don't recommend all-in-one tools like Builderall is um, they're not specialists. Um, because they have so many features that they're kind of like a jack of all trades and you can't be the best at anything if you're a jack of all trades. So if, if I want the best page builder, I'll go with ClickFuddles because the pages just look better. It's the most robust. If I want the best email manager, I'd go with GetResponse. I mean, their support is fantastic. Uh, their deliverability is as good as you'll find, you know, within a reasonable price range. Um, you know, it's it's very easy to use. Um, Click Magic, I, nothing compares to Click Magic. Um, so you want to go with the the specialist. You don't want to go with these jack of all trades. Um, you know, that that, that oh, that's my recommendation. Um, now, lastly, you aren't really saving that much money if you think about it. I mean, seventy six dollars and ninety cents a month. Whereas if you, um, whereas if you got all these separate, you might end up spending 150 to 160 dollars a month so yeah you're saving 50 percent but you know it's really not that much if you think about it and if you can't afford 150 or 160 dollars a month then frankly you have no business being in business so that's that's my honest opinion even if that sounds a little harsh that that's that's honestly how i feel now some people might say you know it's easier um um than you know so using a software like Builderall is much easier to have everything in one place. 
versus going out, finding different software and integrating everything. And I don't think that's true actually. Um, it's, it's, it's not that difficult to integrate. You can watch free videos on YouTube where if you have a good course that's gonna teach you, it's not a big deal. And you only have to integrate everything once. You don't have to go back and keep integrating it. It'll take you maybe one day, one afternoon, and then you're done and you never, never have to think about it ever again. So, so that's not, um, so, so that's, that's not a good reason to go with um, Builderall. Anyway, so what's my, what's my final verdict? Do I recommend Builderall? I would say if you're incredibly, you know, you're just very cheap or, you know, you're really on a tight budget, then sure, you, you can go ahead and buy Builderall. Um, but, you know, eventually I would recommend upgrading and, you know, getting these tools that specialize in one area. That's my two cents and you could take it for what it's worth. But look, you're here obviously because you're looking for a way to earn money and earn money from the comfort of your own home. Uh, if that's the case, what I what I suggest is click the link below. You'll see my email opt-in page. Enter your best email. I could send you my free training that'll detail how to put this all together, how to uh, you know integrate all these different tools, how to get traffic or eyeballs, how to uh, find a great product to sell, and just how to put everything together. So. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Hope to see you on the other side and I hope you have a great day. Bye.